Myers to actually drop mix CDs and get about $10 a pop. They drop about five or 10 a year. Y'all do the math. $10 a pop is what he was getting on the CD. So y'all do the math, and you know you add that up for all you dumb people. That's about fifty thousand in his pocket per CD, and, and you can't really account for that money. So the IRS, y'all can catch us later on, and uh, we'll deal with y'all. But fresh, I'm about to start selling records with y'all. Keep the ball back. Well, you know, it, it's real. And fresh, man, a lot of people don't know, bro. You really like working with underdogs. Oh yeah, give me the underdog dude, and we gonna make it happen. You know, See? Cause they don't get a chance to do their thing. You know, and just to let y'all know to throw it out there, I still take street money, you heard? You know what I'm saying? Just make sure when you come, it's counted out and all that, and it's right, you know, hand it to me, and, and it's done. We ain't got to speak on it, you heard? <laughs> <laughs> and the other thing I say, man, bro, how do you, you know, how to, everybody who I come in contact with who deals with you fresh, they always say that, um, you know, Manny Fresh, he ain't changed. But they don't understand. You've been through the, the record label oh, yeah. with RCA. I can tell y'all some stories that'll hurt y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and put it out there. Manny Fresh, all them hi hats and all them beats, all them drums y'all used to hear on them SWVs on RCA, on the cool. Manny Fresh did that in that, in that magazine article in the Double XL. When they asked him about it, Manny Fresh spoke on it, and ain't nobody said nothing else about it because guess what? It was a true story. And if he wanted to go collect some ends. He better be glad I ain't his manager, because I'll be going there shaking them punks up, getting that scratch from them. But um, other than that, though, Fresh, man, I just wanted you to come on here and show some love to Trey. I told you who he was. You said you'd do it. Most definitely. Real, recognized, real. Trey's album, same thing, different day. It'll be in stores by the time y'all see this. So, <laughs> I got um, a, and I got a, you know, I got a tribute to school. But, um, Bun B, you know, it's going to be on his album. Y'all need to check that out. See, that's free game. Bun Bizzle, we going to see I'm gonna try to get that exclusive on this one. You know, I'm gonna try to make a phone call to make that happen. Why? Wow. Now, see, guess what though? Y'all don't know this, but I'm just trying to see what I can't do for this for this CD and trade. Again, all money is good money. Ain't no such thing as bad money. If it is bad money, come give it to Lump. And I'm gonna tell you how bad it is after I spend it. But I just wanna say to my homeboy Trey, Trey's actually working the camera right now. Y'all don't even know this boy's working. And uh, he's a little homie who came to me real. I've been working with him for a couple of years, like I told y'all earlier on the DVD. But this is the type of stuff you get when you stay real. Not really only you staying real, but just being honest. And uh, y'all just keep your head up. Same thing, different day. Signing off with a multi-platinum producer. On another tip, y'all look for me in my porno flicks, knocking them down, you heard? <laughs> Fresh style, <laughs> coming out. Hold on, I, see, I ain't even talking about that right there. I, I, he tried to get somebody to get in trouble. When your album coming out, bro? I don't know, dude. I ain't finished. I'm looking for a couple of more underdogs on it, you heard? Go check it out. We might be able to get Trey on that, huh? Yeah. If he's spitting right. For sure. When well, he's spitting right. Now, what's the name of the album? Cars, Clubs, and Holes. They gonna let you put that on the album? Cause, clubs, and hoes. In parentheses, it is what it is. Hurt? This is Lump signing out, man. Same thing, different day. Trey, in stores, man. Y'all gotta get it. And, bro, if you want me to host your tape, if you want me to host your DVD, because I'm doing an excellent job, holler at me. And if your check is correct, actually, I don't even want no check. I either, if I get a check, it's gotta be a cash check. Nah. I need some, some whole, cold, hard, green cash. Only Trey get this type of treatment if you part of the family. But everybody else, man, I'ma interview y'all and then get some folks on here, but y'all gotta cut a check. But this is Lump signing off. Again, Trey, same thing, different day. This is the first independent album. It's four CDs for the price of one. You get the regular version. You get the snap version. You get the clean version. He's doing something for the kids. And you're getting a DVD. That's four for the price of one. And you get to see me hang with Manny Fresh. Fat Boys is coming back. We making our comeback, y'all. So we gonna sign Winger out right now. Winger slash Slinger, you heard? See, I ain't into that, bro. Plus Singer, you heard? Yeah, that's 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 Manny Fresh, man. I see y'all later, bro. See, this your boy Z. Man, look at you. You going down out here? If you ain't out here, you ain't where it's going down. <laughs> Sweet.
myself. You know what I'm saying? The ghetto stupid just ain't playing with these boys. Right? Just, yeah, 100. I never thought I'd say. Thank one, man. My pride on the wrong road, trying to follow my pride. I was daddy for a while, though I've got no seat. But the kids on my A A R T. I see you on another note today, huh? Yeah, right. Regular old day, man. Yeah, man. Just like you know. Go introduce yourself. I'm one at a time. <laughs> The Out New 107 Jazz representing hip hop and the RB flavors. David the Sugar Shad. We got special guests today. Trey in the house. And I tell you what, they got the big celebrity basketball game going on. Of course, it's going to be at Lake Charles Boston tonight at 6 o'clock. And Trey, hey man, tell me a little bit about yourself. Where you from? What's up? What's up on the agenda for tonight? Well, I'm Trey from Gorilla Mob, ABN. You know what I'm saying? Screwed up quick from Houston, Texas. Now here representing, we're going to go up to this little celebrity basketball. Game. I let the little ones from Slabs Lil Live Bang and represent so high I go, you know what I'm saying? I feel you, bro. And I tell you what, it's gonna be all good. It's all for charity, and uh, of course, it's the, uh, the uh, actually it's the Third Coast Magazine birthday bash is going on. Tell me a little bit about your product that you got. Uh, you know, tell me some of the stuff that you put out and everything. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, probably got more albums out there than any catch you gonna run across. Like the last album we've been really just pushing with the losers and composers. I had a couple of hot singles off that, that old knowing days of my life that do well. That album doing real good. It's still sub up the towards the end of last year. So right now we get ready for my new one called Same Thing, Different Day. That's soon to be released probably within the next month and a half, two months. For sure. But I tell you what, all the work that you have done, what was your favorite? What, what, what probably would be your favorite? You know, I would mean, So much, huh? Yeah, it's so much. Last underground I did with me and Zero, uh, AB, and I can't really say the meaning over the hell. But you know what I'm saying? We just put that out. So right now, like I say, we'll be pumping with that music and clothes, and then Zero have like the choice of the day. Yeah, we get ready for my new trace same thing different day. Now, in the near future, are you going to be going on tour? Uh, I'm going to get a tour to play every day. Every day. I, I, I see some of the work you be doing in the studio. Uh, actual studio time, when you get in there, man, how long you know, does it take you to just put the, lay down some stuff and have it really ready to go? I'm going to be surprised, man, if I just did, like I said, the underground, ABN. That was probably nominated for one of the top undergrounds of the year. We did that in less than two days. So really, we used to just get the man do it. I mean, okay. if you give us a week, I guarantee you we have a five album for you. That's a good level. We're blessed to do so. We're doing it on the radio. For sure. We don't think I'm wrong with us. I tell you what, kids that are right now listening to you, you know, people listen to you, kids listen to you, what advice would you give them so far as becoming a rap artist or an artist uh, uh, in the industry and what should you think they should do to, to get, get on top? Really, man, my, my main thing, I, I came with different strokes, different folks. Only thing I can say is it got to be in you, because what it is, this game will stretch because you're going to go through your ups. You're going through way more down than you'll go through ups anyway, you know what I'm saying? So you got to be able to maintain with all the boulders and everything being thrown at you, you know what I'm saying? Learn how to shake them off or do whatever you got to do to keep it going. Because when you run through your first problem and you try and give up right there and nothing, it's just like, but you definitely got to shake the haters off. Yeah, yeah. Not even even that just any kind of struggle that you're going through, you still got to maintain for it, you know what I'm saying? Because, like, we came from no money, you know what I'm saying? We came from just being in the hood, cats we just had a little talent, and we want to get heard. But soon enough, I mean, I've been doing this since I was like 12, 13, I'm 23 now. 
I really not to get my shine on, you know what I'm saying? So that's a long, that was a long time here. But this was this was in me, so this is what I'm gonna do. I feel you, Trey from H Town in the house. They're gonna be matter of fact, they're gonna be having be out at uh, Lake Charles uh, Boston today. Uh, uh, tonight, brother, 6 o'clock for the big celebrity basketball game that's going to be going on. All the guys, you got a bunch of celebrities out there like Trey and all that. Trey talking about he didn't want to be on. He didn't want to go on the court. He didn't want to go on the court. What's up, dog, with that? I'm my little brother, Jay, talking to Slab, be on, on the hoop mission, so I'm going to let them go do their thing, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna lie, I'm just a uh, camp for the hood and like to lay back and chill. Well, you about as big as Shaq, dog, so don't even, don't even go there, you know what I'm saying? I know you be hard to paint. Yeah, I ain't, I ain't, man, I ain't warm myself up for I ain't gonna embarrass myself with nobody. <laughs> hey, well, thank you so much, Trey, for stopping by, man, and yeah, we'll, we'll see you tonight. Yeah, we have the stuff for the kids, I mean, whatever, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna be, we're gonna make sure everybody has their fun, you know? And when is this new album gonna drop? I want to say, uh, I want to say within a near month, a month and a half, the album's done right now. It's just it's being set on because they trying to give me a deal off the album. So. Okay. And the name of it one more time so they'll know. Same thing, different day. Don't worry, they'll know because I'm going to make sure you get to the single early. So. <laughs> I <laughs> feel you, man. Down. Thanks so much, Trey. I'm David the Sugar Shot. Of course, we're representing hip-hop and R&B flavor. It's all new right here on 107 Jams. Three zero. Down here in Lake Tall, my motherfucking nigga Top will get ready to drop his shit. Get Trey, same thing, different day. I'm gonna let him tell you how it got going. Y'all know exactly how it's going down, you heard me? From the N.O. to H-Town, we holding it down. This is a real chopper right here. Fuck that other nigga. I'm gonna come back to that. Yeah, you heard me? <laughs> What's happening with me, you heard me? Ain't no more, no limit. Straight ball of body here, Roy Jones, Jr. You be looking out, you heard me? Look out for the fight, collab with me and my nigga. Shot Jesus. I'm 
Man, this motherfucking underground shit ain't ready for slam, baby. We in here, it's that nigga Rick D, baby. I'm in here with Trey. I wait out here, you know. Fuck Rick D. <laughs> yeah, fuck that. Eight years. Look at that, I ain't gonna make him out. Rick D, either. Yo. Cakes and all you pricks, they down. Street boys, slab and train, you know we gotta represent H-Town. I think you, I get it, you know, this regular well. West well, you know. We stay jazzed up out here, you know. Boys be wanting to see us, want to be like us. And if they can't, they talk down on us. Because, like, you know. You know, it go down on the way, you know. You know, go down on the way, you know. up, nigga? Anybody got a problem, nigga? Wake up, nigga. Wake up. Like all day, nigga. CV, nigga. I don't mind you putting on that, but put yourself on it sometime. Put yourself on it sometime. Put my friends on that. Put them on there. No, no, I don't know. I, I, I don't want to be on there with you, pal. Sit down anyway. They don't want to be on there with you, man. They say you better know by yourself. Don't put me on it. God damn. Look at this garbage ass bitch here. Yeah, we doing a demonstration on how dirty nigga this be. And that nigga shit clean today, damn. That nigga shit clean today, damn, that's fucked up. Nigga pervert. Man, they try to beat me up, dawg. Shit, he put a picture in or something. Nah, I can draw some clippers. Uh. What is this? It's, it's live and fire, baby. We just out here just chilling, baby. You know how it goes. Yeah, yeah. Dubs up. That's how we do it. What you get? Man, that bitch gonna hurt. Can I hurt? That bitch gonna hurt. Hurt like a motherfucker. Bitch gonna hurt, I promise. All right, so you want it like that? Yeah. I mean, it's gonna, it's gonna be something you can take, though. You, you're straight. Straight, though. Man, that was Bishop and his gay customer, dog. I'm telling you, I got the boy to talk. Did you hear the, the, the punk in his voice, man? <laughs> What you got to say about that? No, homosexuals allowed. Yeah. Debuting. <laughs> July 3rd, baby, 2004. Sim Stoves. We're going to go get it. Go pity. So yeah. Out. Them messed up up that dumb, dog. What? Trey's just right. black. That's blood, y'all. That's the boy blood. You got me fucked up. That's the boy blood, man. It's ink. Man, that's his blood, baby. That's just how I look. I know this dumb ass dope in there. Nigga ain't run off my $20. I'm finna go check this boy. Check this boy. Say, bitch, what took you so long, ho? You try to run off my money, bitch? Huh, bitch? Yeah. Bitch, come here, bitch. Bitch, don't run off me, bitch. Get your whole ass in here. Get your bitch ass in here, dog. Come on. Pull your pants up, bitch. Pull your, come on, bitch. Pull your motherfucking pants up, bitch. Oh, you just gonna sit and sit on the grind, dog? That's how you gonna do it? Get my motherfucking chain, bitch. Trey, what you wanted from the stove? A Kit Kat bar. Oh, you want you want a Kit Kat? Uh, that chocolate thing, that thing in chocolate Kit Kat, that thing now? 
Nah, man, my... <laughs> I, yeah, the boy want a Kit Kat. Hey.
nigga named Jesus. Ripping the dub with SLA BZ. Joseph Wayne, I'm here to put black eyes in the game. Wouldn't give a fuck about rapping, I'm a gangster, you know my name. Some people call me the crooked, some people call me the dumb. Some people call me heartless, cause if it's beef, I smoke your moms and your papa and your uncle Eddie. Nigga, this war for real, I suggest you go get your people ready. Cause I'ma slide by and fuck a drive by. I'ma put my shit in park and straight up hopping out. Sound like applause on the streets, all these Uzi shells dropping out. Fuck with Mr. McVay and you die. Living it like I'm seeing for live for life. I pistol grip with motherfuckers at all times. Baby blew up in the Rico, leaning to the left side. We willing down South McGregor, bending corners in the tray. No license or insurance, but I ain't legal anyway. Go and jump on the run, cause my boy got a color. One look to my nigga Yuck Mouth for your night in the ghetto. We all got up.